Hey, Pleasant Good Day, everyone. This is Sportsnet News. I'm Joe Boric, and this is going to be a short video on the Philadelphia Phillies acquiring a pretty good in Darium Gutierrez outfield talent. Not breaking any rules. You're allowed to do some stuff um, during the lockout when it comes to this, according to MLB writer Gabrielle Starr. Um, when she says, which stipulated no free agent signings, big league trades, or even contracts between team owners or executives and players, this move is nothing but, um, it's nothing um, basically bad or daring by the Phillies are allowed to make this move signing an international free agent. And it's a noteworthy thing for a team that has to keep rebuilding the farm system. But Gutierrez was a good ranked national prospect. And according to uh, editor Francis Romero, who has been able to watch him down there in Cuba, the Cubana native is a legitimate outfield talent who has a beautiful arm, a very good swing from the video I've been able to find on him, including the one that was pictured uh, in the article from Francis Romero's Twitter. Um, he seems like a guy that has a nice, sweet, smooth swing. Obviously, uh, he is a guy at only 19 years old. The big leagues are ways away, but he's a good talent to bring into a system, um, really obviously, that is desiring anybody else that can come in to continue to add to that prospect core, because it's still a weak core in terms of top-notch talent. But you have some good B-minus, B-level guys that might be able to mix into the uh, cream of the, with the cream of the crop guy, but you don't have that cream of the crop guys minus like the painters and the ables and all that at the top that are pitchers there. It's nice to add into the outfield. You have some guys like Muziati, who's a promising talent among others like Ortiz. So it's nice to add in Gutierrez, who unlike Ortiz, who struggles in the fielding aspect, this guy, um, all things reported, is a very good fielder as well. And it has above average speed and very good arm strength and is described as an explosive player from Romero. So I think this is a very nice pickup in the overseas docket. A lot of guys this far have not figured, uh, excuse me, have not worked out for the Phillies uh, when it comes to picking guys up from overseas. But it doesn't mean the next guy is not going to work out where maybe Gutierrez can be our first spark uh, out there that we get from overseas guys and works out really well. And also... We have other guys here like Ortiz and Muziati who also could work out really well. So I think this was a nice pickup by the Phillies being able to get in the international market with the international pool. You're able to get a guy like Gutierrez with above average speed, talent, a swing that looks like he's going to develop into a major league talent. Plus, you also have now for Darren Gutierrez a whole new development team. You have Preston Manley. You have hired a million people this offseason and moved out a million other people to have this whole new development system and team here in place in Philadelphia. So I think he's coming into a new, hopefully, vibe and a new culture with the team when it comes to putting guys in the right position and not just overusing the current analytics of baseball to just kind of group everybody in one sector, but using them correctly to be able to put the guy in the right spot and to be able to figure out the best things for his swing and for his fielding ability and for his hitting ability. And that is what I think they'll be able to do better with this core, where before the Phillies, I think, were just trying to kind of two-group or one-group people, which was not a good way to do it. So I hope you all enjoyed this video on the signing of Darian Gutierrez out of Cuba, who is going to be able to come into a system and probably will be a top-10 prospect right away, honestly, because we don't have the peachiest of clean top level talent system. We have some good B minus, B level, even B plus level prospects, and then the A levels with the Ables and Painters, but you want to be able to mix in guys that have a chance to become other A level guys, and I think this guy might have a chance to do that. So peace out, everybody. Stay safe, and special thanks to those of you that have subscribed, and please continue to subscribe if you enjoy the content down below. Really love you for the support. Peace out, everybody, and go Phillies. Continue to do what you got to do. I'll be doing a video on the Rule 5 selection that also, of course, didn't break any rules. The Rule 5 draft still went on that the Phillies were able to make today as well later on. Peace out, everybody, and stay safe.